All right, Colin, those two big guys obviously set the tone. How difficult is that to overcome? Um, it's tough, especially they're both like, they both take up a lot of paint, uh, room in the paint. So, especially for us, um, it's tough like rebounding out of position and rebounding out of area. But I felt like we, we continue to battle, especially the bigs, Tristan and Larry, they continue to fight. And then when Big Z came in, he, he gave us good effort. When you did cut it to 11, was there a feeling in the bench in the huddles that you could oh, yeah. still pull that thing off? Absolutely. Uh, I feel like we was on a run and we was rolling. So when it's like that, you feel like anything's possible. You said uh, you hurt your hip, I think it was in the first quarter. Did you cut, cut, which hip? What's the, what, what's uh, the, left field. It was when I had laid drumming. First possession, I had laid him, but I'm good. Coach, did you want to take you? Like, you didn't play fourth quarter. Do you think it was precautionary? Just, you know, oh, no, no. I, I could have continued playing. Uh, we're good. Just get ready for the next one. You've seen the fruits of your labor with the jump shot. I mean, it looks looks smooth. It looks consist- consistent. I'm continuing to work on it uh, each and every day just because um, I feel like if I'm making shots, then it's going to open everybody up, all my other aspects of the game, like passing the ball, um, getting to the lane, just to open up shots for my teammates also. So I got to do my part and make sure I work on my jump shot to get it get it down.